Hey there, friends! In this video, we've got new stories about the world which he finds discovered recently. Let's cut right to the chase! An American U-Boat the underwater research expedition of the Russian Navy and the Russian geographical community to the islands of Kirill Ridge was finished this summer. During the expedition, a detailed hardware survey of the bottom surface near Matua Island was carried out, including using a manned submersible vehicle. An American submarine herring, which sank during the World War II, was examined with a detailed photo and video recording of the object. The submarine was sunk by Japanese coastal artillery during its eighth combat outgo, the task of which was to combat Japanese shipping in the Kuril Islands. Together with the boat, 83 people on board were killed. After leaving the base at Midway Atoll on May 21, 1944, the submarine transmitted a report of the sinking of two Japanese ships, Ishigaki and Hokuyamaru, on the night of May 30 to 31st. Then the contact was lost. As it became known later, on the morning of June 1st, the submarine attacked and sank two more merchant ships, Hibirimaru and Iwakimaru, in the harbor formed by the strait between the coast of Matua and the small island of Taporkovi located nearby. When departing along a narrow, shallow waterway, the boat, which was in a semi-submerged position, couldn't maneuver and was fired upon by Japanese coastal artillery. After reaching deep water, the boat sank, and apparently sank due to the damage received at a depth of 330 feet. Currently, the hull of the boat is located two kilometers south of the island of Matua. Russian divers installed a brass plate with a full list of the crew and the name of the ship on the hull of the submarine. T-26 tank The restoration of the T-26 tank with a number of 532 destroyed in the summer of 1942 has recently been completed. Parts of the tank were recovered from the river by a search party and sent for restoration in 2019. While the restoration work was underway, it was possible to find out the circumstances of the crew's last battle. From July 18 to 20, two T-26 tanks went on combat mission to cover the withdrawal of Soviet infantry units across the Seversky Donetsk River. When completing the task, the tanks took an unequal battle against the 48th Tank Corps, the Great Germany Division, a battalion of enemy motorized infantry supported by several dozen German tanks. While fighting against enemy forces exceeding their 10 times, tanks with crews were killed. Number 532 received multiple holes from shells in the hull from all sides and was then blown up as a result of detonation of ammunition. The tank was completely restored and handed over to the Sambek Heights Museum in honor of the fallen heroes who defended their native land from the Nazis at the cost of their lives. An aerial bomb a World War II bomb was discovered during excavation work in Volgograd. The miners and police were called to the place. Such an ammunition poses a great danger to residents of the neighboring houses. The dangerous find was loaded onto a truck and transported to the military training ground, where it was undermined by the overhead charge. It is worth noting that this is the fifth aviation bomb destroyed by the miners this year. That's all for today and thank you all for watching. Subscribe to the channel so as not to miss new videos.